we're leaving to head across to KI with absolutely no wind. Just grab that mooring ball, and this has just been surfaced. It's got a ton of growth on it. Obviously, it collects it as it flows in, and another sea wind. A few birds. So you can see how much we're spinning here. This is nearly a full 180 degree turn just here. We have been spinning around doing full 360s. We were facing out the river, we're now facing up the river. A bit dark the sun's just gone down the moon's up and it's a lunar eclipse we've got the time lapse going and we should have got half of it at least going into the eclipse perfect night dead still we're not swinging hopefully it all stays in focus that is far less visible to the naked eye that's clearly the blood moon Scared the other ones off and now oh, they are. If I come back and your face covered in shit, you'll be real happy. <laughs> Is that because they scared him off yeah. the other boat? Yeah. No, I scared him I off know. the way in. He scares him off that red boat where they're quite happy. Yeah. Hey, Dodge scared them off last night with that clap of thunder and they shat on our boat because of it, so I had no pity. That's They thought it was you. They look quite stumped, it was funny, yeah. <laughs> I look quite stumped now. Yeah, that was close. Yeah, that was anyway, close. so what are we doing? So we're off to Kingscote today. Finally got weather that's not blowing from the north. This is totally unprotected from the north. Oh, hang on, I want a video. This is... Love boat, yeah. <laughs> it's the, what, the American... Yeah, love American River. Love boat. Love boat or life boat? Love boat. Love boat, it's full love of birds. Boat. Look at the birds. It is, and it's it's sunk a couple of times, isn't it? Apparently so, yeah. Mm. You get to just keep pumping it out. Did you notice last night while all that... We've got our satellite back. One second. We've got our satellite. Two guys. Oh, we've been cut now, 16 knots. Oh, lucky we won that first three. Second three. Seven and a half knots. I know. You going that slow? Oh, <laughs> you getting ready? When do you want to go? You're to go tell the story. A little bit more until the green line hits it. Like, yeah, when? You ready? Ready? Not going on again. Just watch that. Bring that in. Yep. Throw that over in my face.
anyway, so I couldn't get anything. Action. Action. All I've got is the clear bin thrown at me. Got it? You got it? Go on it. Shopping? Hey, Chris, I think Pete's ahead of you. He pulled that out of his ass. Shush, don't tell Tony. Where does that go? Take the... How'd you pull that out your ass? Right, right, right. I was about to give up the shit here. I was about to go. Oh, okay. Are you kidding me? No. He's bitten both of your hooks. You know what? You're in trouble now. No, you can't leave my hook. Oh no. That's your problem. I'll get it right back. <laughs> he has completely swallowed that. You're going to have to wrestle it out of you. <laughs> Just put it in for the rod holder behind you if you want. And then... How could it have both hooks in its mouth? Well, he might have been hungry. So... Well, you sleep it on the first bite. <laughs> Pete caught some. I'm so do I, but that was a while ago. I mean, did you catch that, Chris? Did you catch one? I caught one. <laughs> was it a whitey? It was a good size whitey. Awesome. And how many did Pete catch? He caught one more. One more. Oh, there's more like than there's more than one in there. There's three in there. So oh. if I caught one, I think he caught two. Yeah, but the other fish. The Tommies don't count. How many the Tommies did you catch? I don't want to catch Tommies. I caught. How many what? catch? I caught oh, another so you caught whitey. One whitey. I caught two whitey. So you caught one whiting. Caught two whiting. Where's the other one then? That one I threw back. <laughs> oh, oh, that one. It's a wee whiting. It's a you can't that it's a was fish. not. That was not even. It's a fish. No size limit. No size limit. So I'm gonna say it's the same. If Your bait was fish. as big as that fish. It was close. To that. Yeah, I was gonna say that didn't even make the length of my finger. How's the skill in catching it though with that hook? <laughs> <laughs> to get it in its mouth. Give me another 8.8. .8. Give me something excited just to show you. We're zooming along. There's a black duck dead ahead. We're bearing down on him. Full bore. He's. <laughs> Well, it's 2.30, 3 o'clock in the morning. It's still pinned in American River with this terrible weather. We've been woken up because uh, the front's come through. We're getting 35 knot gusts at the moment and the boat's side on because of the current and we're rocking horribly. We've still got about another four hours of tide flow. So yeah, it's pretty awful. You hear the wind rattling around. What do you say? Winter is coming. No, summer is coming. Yep, it's definitely summer. No, wait. Okay, winter is back again. Welcome to Australia. That sums up, we've got two weeks left, and then it's meant to be summer. We've missed spring completely. <laughs> I think we've had two days of sunshine. And we've got one day weather window to get further down the coast, oh, and no, then so. it shit comes again. And there's another 30, 40 knots and we're pinned them stuck. Yeah, we had a crappy night last night. Hey, it's rain coming.
leaving American River on our way now out, just going to anchor in the bay out here at American Beach and maybe anti Chamber Bay tonight, heading off to Victor and then down the southeast, heading to Cape Jaffa. Finally got a weather window in almost two weeks before another big blow of 40 knots. So yeah, pretty rough down here at the moment. It's been a really wild spring. It's freezing. Cool. So gold. This is part of Kangaroo Island that most people don't get to see. You can't get to it by road, um, and it's probably not somewhere that people come by see. One layer off. My winter jacket, I'm freezing. I'm actually quite warm in the sun. And the sun, that makes a difference. The wind's dropped back, back a bit, so it's... We've just arrived on Anti Chamber Bay. We've just uh, souped into the beach. A little bit more sunshine, and this will be lovely along here. We're getting ready to head off from Anti Chamber Bay on the very eastern tip of Kangaroo Island. It's a little bit rolly here, certainly wouldn't have wanted to stay here overnight. Uh, just having our dinner, finishing off with our pizza we just made earlier, and got our overnight sail. A little bit rusty, we haven't been out for a while so it's not going to be pleasant. I don't know who's going to be up for most of it. It's now almost 6pm, um, we are just turned the engines on, you can hear them rumbling in the background, and we're now just about to pull anchor and head off from Anti Chamber Bay. Sailing all night, and most of tomorrow into Cape Jaffa where we're going to pull in there overnight. So it's time to go. Lastly, we use the bridle to lock it all up nice and tight.
on the outtake. Well. Well.